And as to the question related to the crisis regulation and solidarity measures, let me just reinstate that you see us here, lawmaking process live on the stage. This is how it is, the European Union. We adopted a mandate of the European Parliament in which relocations were the mandatory solidarity, and that was the ultimate expression of solidarity in the crisis regulation. And then came the Council, which is also in place, resisting the mandatory relocation solidarity as the only possible choice. So we have strived real hard for years. It's been a hell of a fight, a uh, real tug of war in order to come with a response that is accepted by both institutions, the Council and the European Parliament, which is to have the final say when it comes to the second reading of the legislative procedure. And that final outcome means that first, the Commission proposal in its implementing decision will propose the solidarity measures to meet the requirements by the Member State, which claims itself in a crisis situation. Second, there will be first choice, the use of the pledges available in the solidarity pool, which is stated in the DRAM regulation. Then, right afterward, if there are enough, if there are enough, if there is not enough response in the solidarity pool to, in order to cover all the needs, then member states will be requested by the Commission to pledge additional solidarity measures adopting uh, to, to, to be incorporated in the Council implemented decision which is to be proposed by the Commission. And if there is, if there is not enough pledges in the Council implemented decision all the needs, uh, to meet all the needs of the Member State, then there will be the mandatory responsibility, so-called offset, to be activated. That means that the contributing Member States shall take responsibility first for all the international protection situation in which the member states facing a situation of crisis has been determined as responsible and to the location needs identified to address the situation of crisis. And second, where necessary, the contributing member states shall take responsibility beyond the fair share, which is the one to be assessed by the Commission. You mentioned some, some, some equation, some equation. There is a solidarity pool by 30,000, and if not, there will be some, but that is a calculation, that is an estimation, it's not written. So the thing is that once the Commission takes hold of the situation, it will call for the member states to come with additional solidarity pledges, and of course, the priority that has been a fight in the crisis situation will be mandatory relocation programs. Mandatory, that will be the priority. That will be the priority, so that certain categories of people, particularly international applicants, will be preferred by the member states, and then the Commission will make sure that the member states will go beyond the so-called fair share as to solidarity response.